Oh no, there's another bus and we've missed it again. There's two buses, although it's really busy. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll run and do this. So we're off to Magic Kingdom today because we didn't get much sleep because we thought one person had set an alarm <laughs> and neither of us had. So the plan was, it's really busy, the plan was to get to Magic Kingdom for seven, but it's now 10 to seven or seven o'clock, I don't really know. I'm gonna die. Anyway, we're off to Magic Kingdom this morning. Oh yay! Thank you very much. on our last day, it's 10 past 7 in the morning, we're at Magic Kingdom, planning to do a full day again. We want to do all the rides pretty much without Smash Mountain. And yeah, we're going to have a good day today. Welcome to our last day. Have a good day. Thank you. We sat there, we were watching Skull Island. And Two weeks flies. How quick does the time go? Anyway, we're not going to talk about it being our last day anymore today. We're going to pretend that this is just a normal day and we're going to go ahead with the day and do everything that we want to do. The first ride of the day. I reckon this is a walk-on. Thank you. Okay. I'm a ranger first class, so are you. The ride stopped and we're right there. <laughs> we're both asleep. Oh, the sun. Do you want to do the astro orbiter? I'm going to switch to scaredy cam for this. I couldn't tell you a ride where I wasn't nervous. <laughs> where to? <laughs> it's very squishy and tight. I'm scared. Yeah, actually. Are you comfortable? Are you comfy? You send me forward. No, I'm alright. I'm gonna do a Claire said an embrace. Whee! This could turn out to be my favourite ride and we've never been on it before. Whee! Oh, you can get dizzy quite quickly, can't you? Oh, I don't like how it tilts, yeah? I didn't expect this! I'm scared. We're tilting. I feel like I've been on the waltzes. When you come down, you get a little bit crushed on your leg. <laughs> I didn't expect it to tilt so much. It's kind of going in as you go around, but I liked it. Nice views this morning, and 
we feel fresh. I love how quiet it is this time in the morning. This is exactly why I wanted to come at this time. Although it is now 10 past 8, which means the park has opened to not more guests. They must have been like the first few logs where no one's on them. <laughs> first few logs of the morning. The time is 11 minutes past 8. What time do you think we're going to get on the ride? But let's play a game. I'm saying half 8. Quarter to nine. 9. Quarter to 9. What? This is where we need David and Ian's subtitles. Oh! I've never seen that go that way before. It's the new style of ride. Leon just said he thinks they're taking it off the track. Up the top, Mum was like, I think everything's on our side today. And now, we're stuck. Three trains well, have gone yeah, three trains have gone past. Oh, Here's another one. We're all camered up, ready. Scared of cam is mum cam. You're saying quarter two. So I said half past eight. Technically, I've won. No. We're just not on the ride. Mum just declared that she wants to come back as a, a Magic Kingdom duck in the next life. Yeah, duck the life of O'Reilly, haven't they? O'Reilly! O'Reilly! <laughs> it's gonna be a long day. So Leon's just grabbing a cinnamon bun for breakfast. Holy moly! Can we fast pass? So we're going to get the cinnamon bun and the muffin. Thank you. First time I've had my eyes open on that drop. No, it's really nice. So 
all the pictures we have with my eyes closed. Not this time. No. I'm a changed man. Ah. Though I can't see a freaking thing now. The story began when Ariel fell head over things in love. Be our guests at one o'clock. It's their first time. We've ordered months ago what we're having, and I've completely forgot what we're eating. Yeah. Toilet. Your favourite attraction. Five songs on it. Yeah, I like it. Different. Play it in your car. Leaving in four minutes. loud. <laughs> she enjoyed that, giving us all pain. Smug look on her face. It is She's too carried away with that. Look at her. Oh. It's the bell this time. Oh no. Oh my god. She's she's loving it. She's going for it. What next? The triangle? Of course. What the hell is she doing? She knows. Look at her. She's gonna dance now. Yeah, I remember it now. Yeah, we had our red sun. Yeah. I'd like to keep my eyes open on it. Oh, we got to do it again today. No. <laughs> oh, I waved at a girl and now she's run off. Story of my life. Are we ready to wave at the Hornet Mansion people? Yeah. Okay. Oh, the bell again. Yeah. Here we go. She does, absolutely. I'll be disappointed if she doesn't. Here we go. Come on. Give us a toot. No, she's no, she's disappeared. She's exhausted herself. She peaked too high. Yeah. She peaked when we left. I do think we should try and do this. Not for a 65 minute wait though. Um, do you mind we're at a five minute check in window right now? Do you mind coming back? They've cancelled it. Should have run along with that. Go to the one on the left because we haven't been rejected by her yet. So just take this rose and the four of you head up to the left side. Oh, perfect. We thought we had to queue in this. <laughs> What's been your favourite queue? Oh, great, okay. No, you can't say the same one. Favourite queue you've ever queued in? Be our guest. This is your favourite queue? The mummy was a good one. 
Oh, James, what was your favourite queue? I'll tell you. Galaxy's Edge Smuggler's Run. Because everything was alive and you get to go on the Millennium Falcon and it was, it was alive. We were on there. I think my favourite rides since we've been here are The Mummy. I know. Big Thunder Mountain with my eyes open and what the Seven Dwarfs with my eyes open. I would like to go on Everest again but not this holiday. You're right. Does everybody remember what they've ordered? Tuna steak? Salad? Ooh! Our calorie counter here. What have you ordered? Can't remember. Ooh, exciting. This is the best room to sit in if you're gonna eat here. And tuna without egg. Here you are, man. Thank you. Here are the muffins. Oh, you got the grey stuff. We got the lemon meringues. How nice to live here. Thank you. Eating too much. The turkey baguette sandwich was lovely. I overdid it with the lemon meringue. Completely overdone it. But we're, we're cracking on. We're going straight to the Horning Mansion. I think you should have your magic band on your ankle. So you have to... <laughs> Paying for your food. Oh, nearly kicked it. Is this haunted room actually stretching? Or is it your imagination? Okay, so the picture is... The picture that they take is the second photo frame on the right. I've disappeared! Sensitive to bright lights. There were people screaming the entire way through, so the cast member just said, just go back round, so we, we went through a wall. Her name is Paige. Thanks, Paige. Let there be music from regions beyond. the ride the first time there were just like school kids just screaming erratically around the whole way so we got off and we spoke to Paige and she just said you can go back round you can cut through here so that's what we did so we've just ridden Haunted Mansion twice in 10 minutes which I think is a record for us. Now we're gonna do the Swiss Family Treehouse thingamajiggy, Robinson, Swiss Family Treehouse Robinson thing. Um, Leon will take this to, well he would fight me to the death saying I've been on this before and I haven't. It's just going to be a brand new experience for me. I feel like I'm in Star Wars. Is he welcome to my new home? Yeah, in the trees. Yeah, I'd love it. There is an actual program on telly at the moment. So people who've got, got a nice bit of land, it goes in, it designs, it goes around the land and you see the trees and he then get his group in, you know, his team, bolt things through the trees and then start making a house in it. It's, it's really, really good. And there we go. Thank you, Julie, for that thrilling um, report on what we should watch the TV guy today. Is this all it is? We're actually just queuing to go up a tree. We knew what it was. I haven't done this before. Quite an interesting tree house. A bit of cardio after the two weeks of donuts. This won't survive for 50 pounds. Yes, it will. This is thrilling. We should have fast passed this. You've got to admit, it's nice and cool though, isn't it? I've never seen it. I've never been on here or never seen it. Is anyone in there? What a contraption. Oh, nice views though. 
I don't really know how I can make this fun in the edit. God, we're right up this tree. I feel like it gets to the point where it's like, we've queued for everything in Walt Disney World. What else can we queue for? Let's go up a tree. You know when we were in the mansion? Yeah. You know when the stairs all go like that? And I said to Laura, oh, this reminds me of the Harry Potter thing going up. You know, when the stairs move? And I said that. That's what I mean. And then I remember if you're on Harry Potter. And that's, yeah, that's... Today's thoughts with Julie. We would have wanted to do Jungle Cruise today, but it's 75 minute wait, and I don't think we have time to wait that long. We managed to get a fast pass for Pirates of the Caribbean this morning when we were looking through the app, and we've got about eight minutes until we can go through the last ride on Pirates of the Caribbean. I think the side seats get the wettest. Wanker now, you swabbies. What we I offer for these hearty heads? Every year we get Alfie a toy and we're just trying to find it. He's had a pretzel before. This is carnage in here today. We don't have those. We do. Nonsense. Poppycock. <laughs> it's four o'clock. We've decided to split the day. We're gonna just leave now. We're having tea at the Contemporary. And then we're gonna watch the fireworks. So we're gonna have maybe about two hours back at the hotel and then come back out and enjoy the night. This is the last time we are leaving this room. No, it's not. Oh no, it's not, because we're leaving tomorrow for the plane. <laughs> Leon came up with the idea of calling the front desk and seeing if we could extend our check checkout. And we're staying until one o'clock in our room, which is great. So we're just gonna have a bit of a hotel day our tomorrow. Because our bus is at quarter past one. We're now off to the Contemporary for tea. Because we had a really nice meal there the other night. And we've decided that that's where we want to eat on our last night. Um, and then we're gonna make our way to Magic Kingdom. That's our plans. You all caught up, let's do it. So we're eating at Contempo Cafe tonight. We ate here a few nights ago and it was so good. Nothing posh, just the, just the dining plan, but it's good enough for us. I was so into my tea, I completely forgot to tell you what we had. I had some chicken and rice. I made some chicken and rice. Laura had a baguette with beef and cheese. Leon had a baguette with beef and cheese. We'll see you at Magic Kingdom. <laughs> go back down, quick, go back down. There's someone weird at the top. Oh yeah, the goat on, the goat has five legs. That's hilarious. Playing a game of who's gonna stand in that ice cream first. Oh, oh that's so close. This is so fun. Oh, nearly. Look out. This one, this one, this one. Oh. Here we go. Oh! 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 <laughs> Not the crocs. This is so tense. Someone needs to distract them so they don't look at the floor. Here we go. Oh! That skimmed it. We have a winner.
It's Monday the 14th, which means it's travel day back home to the UK. You can see I'm packing all my stuff. I really don't know how I'm going to get everything in my suitcase, in all honesty. I've just bought more clothes than I have in my whole entire wardrobe at home. That's it. I've had such a nice holiday and I've probably been counting down for this holiday close to 500 days and now it's all over but we've made some really good memories and I'm deciding to end this video now here just because I don't like filming. I don't want to relive what comes next having to get on the plane again and having to go home and back to reality like this was a a holiday vlog and so I'm gonna end it here thank you for watching I really appreciate whoever watches my videos and I hope you found it interesting entertaining I'm not the kind of vlogger that would give you loads of Disney information because I just don't know it I come here not really knowing much but I just tag along for the ride I enjoy the holiday and I'm in love with Disney World thank you for watching and I guess I'll see you later.